Hey guys, this is Lita. So I have a teeny Halloween haul for you guys. That shit is so loud. Why? Alright, so small, minuscule Halloween haul for you guys. Not much, just some of the stuff that I found before I went into employment oblivion with my company. So saving, saving, saving at the worst time for me to buy upgrade stuff in my house, <sighs> decorate my house, which is full already but still like I think I can rotate stuff like I use it I put it out for other people so they can use it so that's my mentality on Halloween bullshit is it right no still doing it anyways so um I don't know where to start um because I have like random places that I've gone to so far and if you guys have any of these stores near you please check them out because they do have Halloween out now um so I guess the first thing that I will do I'll do Cracker Barrel <clears throat> so this is from Cracker Barrel it is a salt and pepper shaker and it's a here lies salt and pepper shakers so one is white and one is black obviously so you can tell which is salt and which is pepper and i guess it comes with a stand which is kind of cool <laughs> i've never like i haven't unwrapped these so i was waiting for this video so we're gonna find out together what it looks like and hopefully I don't drop it. So this is here lies salt, here lies pepper, and they come on this like gray stand so you just set them like this on your table. And um, these are a lot better made than what I saw at TJ Maxx past years. Like the writing is legible, so you know what the fuck you're picking up. So that was a big thing for me when TJ Maxx had the same thing, two tombstones, but they you couldn't read what the hell the spice was, so I wanted quality, not quantity for price. So the next thing I will talk about is um I guess I'm gonna do Dollar Tree. So I got this, if you guys watch this channel, I got this to do Sam's Halloween pin video. So that's what this is from. It's just a foam pumpkin that you can carve out. Does it work that well? Not really. I wouldn't. If you don't want to carve your own real pumpkins, I wouldn't invest in that. Even though it's a dollar, it was a pain in the ass, to be honest. But if you only have a dollar to spare for pumpkins, go at it. If you <laughs> are creative, I think you can make it work. So, yes, um, I made it work with that pumpkin. I wasn't paying 20 for Michael's, even with a 40% off coupon, which they have the legit carved, carved pumpkins. So, I used that. It worked, obviously. So, and then the other thing that I got from... Um, Dollar Tree. So I bought a bat, um, just a plastic bat, which is in my rear view mirror. And then I bought a ghost, which isn't working anymore. So I didn't put it in the hall. And then I bought these bat lights, which are purple bat lights. I haven't tried them yet. I don't know, but in general, Dollar Tree lights do work. So I paid a dollar for 10 lights that are probably pink, purple, not purple. And they're happy, but um, I want to put them in my car. So 
I'm gonna deal with that because Michael's is asking too much and there's shit that I want to spend my 50% off coupon on besides lights. So, the next thing I will talk about is Goodwill. I did go to Goodwill. I did find something at Goodwill that I was pretty happy with. So, it's this, um poison bottle. I'm not sure if you guys are going to be able to see that because of the light, but it's a, it says poison right here. There's a skull right here. This was originally from TJ Maxx and whoever bought it paid eight bucks for that. So I got it for one fifty. A fucking steal. There's some problems with it. It's losing paint on the inside for some reason, but I really don't care. Even if it like loses that orange color, fine. Um, and then I will talk about Michaels and then we will do Dollar General. So my Michaels sucked last year. They didn't have these bat um, candle holders or the coffin that um, Sam from Halloween Happy got me. And I was really upset about that because my Michaels was dropping the ball because there's people that are gonna buy this stuff in this area even though I don't know them, they will. Um, I love this bat candle holder. This is on my mantle for sure. And I'm going to buy another one with a 40% off coupon. So there's that. I just, it's well made. Um, it's not cheap. It's heavy. It's good quality. So I'm happy to buy it. And there was a Raven one with a skull and I know I'm into crows, but God, the bats just look so much better than the crows on this candlestick. So and then the next thing that I bought from Michael's, I had to have, even though I have this hung up in my house already by Spooky Boss Club, it is, oh my God, are you going to be able to see it with my ring light? Shit, I don't even know. Um, let me put my hand over there and see if you can see it. So it's home sweet haunted home and there's a bat and it's very like, um, decorated with like dripping beads and filigree and it's very it's very victorian in my opinion god you can't see shit with this light oh kind of but you can see like the uh the beads and stuff so i love that so i i needed to have that so that was my first purchase with a 40% off coupon for my goals. The bat candle holder was also 40% off. So those are the only things I bought from Michael so far. I am buying everything with a coupon this year. We are saving. And then the last things that I have to show you guys. Well, one is from Dollar General and it's these little rock guys. So I had to have them and I'm going to clear them. But one of them says, go back with a cat and a bat and go back, close in the dark. And then this one says danger ahead. And this says beware. So these are gonna go in my garden because they are meant for that. That's my purpose anyways. And then the last thing I will show you guys is I got this from uh, Toys R Us. It is a Monster High make your like own sign uh, with your name on it. And my boyfriend Robert did this for me because I was like, I can't figure it out. There's a coffin right here. Like, how do I get this to show whatever and a skull and everything. And like, he just made it for me. He was super quick about it. So yeah, this is, um, a monster high, like name plaque 
that they are selling, which I took advantage of because it was on clearance, so yay! Um, so I was happy to have that too. Excited. Anything for the coffin that I can put my name on. Yep. So thank you guys for watching. Um, comment down below if you guys have had any opportunities finding Halloween stuff in your stores in your area. I would love to know. I'm excited. I just even want to see Halloween even if I can't like spend money on Halloween. So let me know what you guys are finding in your stores. And follow me on other social media. I follow back on all my links will be posted down below. So hit the notification bell if you, so you guys can know when I upload. Thanks for watching guys. Bye.